because when you said yes that day, you made me the happiest man in the world. All my worries and stresses that day seemed to disappear. And I remember letting our close friends and family know it was really exciting and it felt like we were on our own wee bubble. For those who are not familiar with humanism, it's just about respecting each other and the world in which we live. It's about family and it's about love. And of course, the greatest of those things is love. And that's why we've gathered here today to celebrate the love between Amanda and Ian. And finally, the radiant, beautiful young woman we see here today. Mum and I are so proud of you, Amanda. Our baby girl has blossomed into this kind, funny, beautiful, intelligent young woman. Amanda, you're our baby girl, and you always will be. But today we'll hand you over to Ian, who we know is going to take such great care of you. I hope with my speech I've done you proud. It's been an absolute privilege and an honour. However, baby girl, be afraid. Be very afraid. <laughs> There is some serious dad dancing on the agenda later. <laughs> I'll soon have you embarrassed again. So Amanda, when I seen you walk down that aisle today, it was like being back in that bubble again. I haven't been able to stop smiling all day. You look absolutely beautiful. Amanda, I promise to make you laugh make you smile and never dampen your Christmas spirit. <laughs> I promise to take care of you and share everything I have with you. You will always be my greatest adventure. I promise that you will be as important to me as Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, I promise never to forget why I'm marrying you today and most of all, never go a day without telling you I love you. You have now both made a solemn and binding commitment and by virtue of these declarations made in my presence and in the presence of your witnesses and guests, I have much pleasure in declaring you married and pronouncing you husband and wife. I invite you to share a kiss. Also, in case I forget, I should add, Amanda is a fantastically well-organised person. Uh, and she's extremely considerate. And despite all that, she went and booked her wedding during the World Cup. So, I met um, Alan last night, Amanda's dad, for the the first time and our lovely mother Lynn and I just want to say to you both uh, congratulations for raising such a fantastic daughter she will be very proud. No insulting Aberdeen or Aberdonians and absolutely no rude or sexual remarks so yeah so apologies to everybody in advance I was expecting a very funny speech and um, this this will be extremely short and extremely disappointing, but um, that's something Amanda's well used to, my brother, to be fair. <laughs> Thank you for making me so happy and agreeing to marry me today, for being my best friend and for sharing the adventures we've had and the adventures still to come. I love you. Mm -hmm.